Welcome to Awakening You channel. We hope you found something here that sparked your interest and assists you in your awakening journey. If you appreciate what we do, please support us. Thank you. Greetings and salutations my beautiful beings of light we meet yet again to share the energies of the Most High and fill your hearts with love. Feel the energies swirl around you as the Creator sends you wave after wave of the purest and highest love and light you will ever experience. Close your eyes and experience the spiritual hug that is available to you within these moments. Breath deeply and allow all the negatives to just be exhaled from your physical form making way for the energies of this linear new timeline to celebrate their entrance into your spiritual realm. Your mile markers say it is time for your new year and what a wonderful year it will be for those that work to make it so. What have you planned for yourself within the timeline my beautiful beings of light? The angelic realm has introduced 12 peace doves into the earth plane's essence to celebrate the spiritual awakening of so many. Watch for their signs as they bring small miracles and insertion points for peace into your atmosphere. Peace be with you my beloveds and peace be with all those that choose to work towards peace. Muster your courage my divine light warriors as it takes courage to step forward in peace during times when war is the focal point. Let your inner peace beacon shine and rotate touching all in your life with the desire for peace. Jot down a description of what peace looks like to you and carry that with you this linear year. We would have you unfold the paper and reread it next year at this time to see what has changed about that definition. You will find my beloveds that as you work with the desire to create peace in your life it will spill over onto others. It will integrate throughout your energy fields as you come into contact with all others that you meet as you exchange data through your energy fields. Just think how many people you talk to, share with, work with etc. What a wonderful gift you will give them in sharing that peace energy with them through your energy field exchanges. Did you not realize that this is what you do my beloveds whenever you encounter another is actually interact with each other's energy fields? This energy field exchange is one reason it is so important to have yourself aligned and attuned at all times to your highest source, the Creator. One needs to be able to sense that not all things exchanged need to be absorbed. It is of utmost importance through your awakening to perceive when you need to clear your energy fields of all the debris and other such that has accumulated there. It is imperative for your well-being and health to clear often. Begin thinking peace, writing peace, talking peace, and putting those intentions out there in the ethers. This is my divine light beings how you go about manifesting peace into your individual realms. It is created one person at a time. Choose peace and introduce it into your families just as you introduce family values. Let peace hold an important place in your family spaces and decorate your walls with its sayings. Helping others remember their ties and remembrance of peace is a gift that is worth your time to give. My beloveds we are not talking about fighting and arguing over peace, but living peace in your everyday moments. Choosing peace over negativity and violence is sometimes not easy to do but this messenger knows that you have those capabilities. For those that have the privilege of holding a newborn, feel the peace that the child brings with it as you hold it while it is sleeping. Newborns come in with peace and it is their environments that changes that perspective as they grow older. Non-peace is a learned expression it is not part of that which you truly are. Violence is also a learned expression it is not part of that which you truly are. That which you truly are has no need for violence, non-peace, or negativity because it knows without a shadow of a doubt what its source truly is. These are the moments to bring your true essence back into a closer alignment with your highest source. These are the golden moments, these are the building blocks to reintroduce peace into your remembrance. Close your eyes and see the twelve peace doves as they soar above you and for you. They extend the olive branch to each of you. Will you accept their gift and reaffirm your true desire to create a peace-filled earth plane? Allow this messenger to take you on a meditative journey to remember the peace that is your to embrace. With your permission this messenger will join you. Find a quiet spot where you will not be disturbed for a while. You may either sit or lay down whichever is more comfortable for you. Cover your physical self with a light blanket if you chill easily. You want no distractions during your meditations so always make sure the physical vessel is comfortable. Invite in at this moment all that you would have join you on this adventure. 
In your imagination ask through prayer for the Creator to send you down a protective ray of white light by saying My Creator I ask for a protective ray of white light to enfold me and lift me up so that I may experience the very highest of vibrations during this journey into my most inner depths of understanding and being. I am protecting myself from anything that is not for my highest good on this journey. I thank you my Creator for assisting me by sending this ray that is now coming down through the corner of the area where I am meditating. It is entering into this physical form, permeating all that is within this beingness presence. The Creator has gifted you with an iridescent white ray, a golden ray plus a divine purple ray for this journey. These are entering into your body through the solace of your feet and moving up through your physical vessel, permeating throughout all of your energy fields into all corners of the area that you are in, then exiting through your crown chakra. The rays are returning to the Creator and cycling back down through you again and back to the Creator in a circular motion. Your breathing in and out is now forming a figure eight around your essence. The sign of infinity is rhythmically continuing over and over again with each in-breath and out-breath. You are now divinely protected and nothing can even communicate with you that is not for your highest good without your permission at this moment if it helps you to visualize by identifying your ego with a symbol or object please do so. Direct your ego self to perch on your left shoulder. Instruct your ego self that it is to only be an observer on this journey. Breath in deeply my divine light beings and feel the lighter relaxed feelings of being divinely guided into this meditation. Breath in deeply and know that you are breathing to the pulse of the Creator. Listen to the Creator's heartbeat and feel the love that courses through you each time you think about this moment. Breath in deeply allowing and seeing within your imagination your guardian angels join you and take your etheric hand to guide you into your spiritual heart chakra your guardian angels, spirit guides and special invited guests are now within your spiritual heart chakra and as you locate and turn the doorknob of the golden door that says to my highest guidance within you cross over the threshold. You find yourself in a white marble corridor. To your left you see the painted arrow on the wall telling you to walk this way. You find that this arrow twists and turns and leads you down a hall. You finally see a door that says open me and you do as instructed the door swings open and you see before you a beautiful mountain vista that stretches out as far as the eye can see. You are guided by your angels to have a seat on the rock facing out over this glorious view. You realize that you are on the highest pike around. You find this amazing and delightful. You see the light playing on the other mountains around you and marvel as the colors change from red, to orange to purple and back again. You breath in and just allow yourself to drink in this place that is silent and calm. It is serene here and a feeling of sacredness abounds your attention is drawn to the sky above you and as you look up you see the twelve peace doves soaring above you all with olive branches in their mouths. They land right next to you and you are amazed at how really large these beautiful white doves are. They each bring you an olive branch and as you accept the branch from each they coo and nod thanking you for accepting and choosing peace. They also bring you two double terminator quartz crystals and ask that you hold one in each hand. Through their mental communication with you they ask you to close your eyes and see peace before you. As you do as directed you notice that the crystals become warm. As you open your eyes you see that laser-like rays of light are shooting from the tops of the crystals out into the glorious atmosphere. You notice as it goes out into the atmosphere that it multiples. You watch fascinated by the laser-like streams from the crystals and can feel the pulsation in your hands of this phenomenon. Your angels smile and tell you that it was your vision of peace and your intent and choice to embrace peace that created this miracle that is now flooding into the atmosphere. Your angels question wouldn't it be amazing if all were performing this same exercise? They further explain that there would be no more war. The crystals begin to slow down their transmissions and then they stop. Your angels tell you that it requires re-energizing them on a consistent basis to continue the peace process that was started here. They ask you to come back often and reconnect with the peace that you found and shared in order to continue sending this peace transmission out into the ethers. You thank them for showing you this place and state that you will be back often to continue your work. For now you realize it is time to return so the angels lead you back into the white marble corridor. Then they lead you back over the threshold, back into your spiritual heart chakra, back to your guardian angel that is keeping your physical form company. You look at this physical entity and identify this with your current mission of spreading peace. 
you are guided back into the physical form. When you are ready wiggle your fingers and toes and open your eyes. Remember always that you are loved more than any earth plane language can describe. Be at peace and embrace the remembrance of who you truly are. I am Archangel Michael, the Creator's messenger, of love, joy, wisdom, light, peace, and grace.